Hello, good afternoon, my dear students. Welcome to the session here. I am bringing you the hot news for the day. Yesterday, we got a verdict from Madhya Pradesh High Court. Madhya Pradesh High Court has given ordinance after completion of their investigation given by this NTA and as well as a committee against to this case filed by the affected studio. So, let us see what exactly the details about this. Dear children, it is very important to re -neat affected students. So, a new NEET will be conducted, re -neat. Let us see the details here. So, Madhya Pradesh High Court orders NEET UG 2025 due to power outage. So, what is the actual investigation happen happened and also what is the actual petitioner want to claim it? Here, it is for you. Exam held on May 14 in 2025. We have centers like Indore and Ujjain hit by a power outage and a dark environment. How come the students are going to write the examination? That is the major issue that has been conducted during the test. Around 600 students initially affected. And these 600 students affected filed a case, a logical action to be taken. Affected candidates filed a petition before June 3, 2025. And the petition has been meticulously pursued by the court. And the court state result declaration of the petitioner. For only for those students? Yes. And also, we are going to see court hearing and highlights. June 19 hearing had happened. So, NDA defended the power outage was there, but they have the arrangement of the proper conduction of examination. But the story didn't happen like that. And judge recreated darkness and meticulously in the classroom to simulate exam conditions. And they found that writing examination in the, the poor lighting condition is going to be so bad. So they decided 19 pages judgment noticed unfair disadvantages due to blackout. Really? And this comes out to be, yes, only those petitioned by June, uh, June 9th, uh, June 3rd, approximately 75 students petitioners are eligible for this contract. And we can see here, court order the re-exam must be held at, at earliest date. How do you feel that re-examination for only for the students and the total state or that examination center? And mention in the comment box. Uh, Hi Sharma, how is many candidates eligible for the re-need? Yes, that is has to be still decided. That's what I want to say. NTI is going to counteract maybe in the Supreme Court. Let us see what can happen. And I can say based on this court arguments and the petitioners and the NTA, there may be a neat examination, re neat examination for the part of the students and definitely government denies to give this uh, total read examination for the entire neat exam to prepared. But there may be, um, uh, de definitely I can say there will be a delay in the neat counseling. So Teja, only 77 or 75? It is 75. And only new re examination scores to de determine the ranks. And also NTA instructed to publish their promptly after re-examination the, based on their results. 75 or 77, it is 75. Navya, and also NTA position. NTA aage kya karna hai? Abhi kaise defend karna hai? And you can say NTA and SG Tushar Mehta argued performance unaffected, backup power and delaying sufficient light. Yes, there is a delay in the examination because of the uh, proper sufficient light and provided statistical report some high court scores despite of outages and they may reach to the high, uh, Supreme Court also and also what is the current status. Definitely I can say there will be a delay in the counseling and re-exam mandated for 75 petitioners. People say it is 77 as far as database is concerned it is 75. And also, hearing concluded June 30, yesterday in 2025. And also, awaiting scheduling and the re-execution of the re-examination, that we have to wait. How NTIE is going to act against this, given I court, Madhya Pradesh High Court is given the ordinance. And also, what are the key takeaways? Will the paper difficulty remain the same? Uh, Navya, if the re-examination is conducted, definitely I can say the paper difficulty level will be plus or minus will be same. And don't worry, the neat examination, let us wait what NTA is going to turn up. 
in this k outcomes quote differentiated based on localized impact and evidence yes it is and also procedural fairness so petitioners has given a petition and the 75 students how fair it is and it uh, how it is impacting to the entire need students who are writing the exam and the petition deadline set is a uh, june 3 and also uh, among the 75 what about the rest of the students near about 600 plus students got impacted right and also re-exam applies only for those timely period <clears throat> and also tension between the preserving examination integrity and individual fairness is also a question mark yeah it is difficult how do you say it is difficult and what we are going to expect next so you want a neat examination and uh, you want anything only for those students that you only decide and you just mention in the comment box so that we can have a discussion based on that so nta to schedule re-examination only for the 75 students is that possible and results will be republished for all the students yes once these 75 students are taken out it has to be and they can't be given a separate result right only re-examination scores to be considered for ranking and there will be in a 75 rank and uh, here about 600 students are included again that is going to be an impact and also remaining candidates unaffected will have the regular results declared already those had already had a good result will that be impacted and these are the all outcomes we can say and uh, this is allowed uh, what happened in the yesterday's high court and from the Madhya Pradesh is given and these are the outcomes Madhya Pradesh uh, court has meticulously visualized the practically and meticulously visualized the impact of the NEET examination happened in the dark environment and uh, court agrees it is true with the committee and there will be a debate between NTA and the high, high court. So there is a chance NTA can approach to the Supreme Court or also NTA may conduct the re neat examination may be for only those 75 students or may be for the entire 600 students affected in that okay so counseling will start in which month once this problem hurdle is completed and the counseling is going to be started as soon as it's possible from the infinity land we are going to update you what exactly is happening and uh, we will come up with the next step from the ntm so we are all done from this and if you have any doubts please let me know uh, rank will be given in the form of options or any other method so rank will be given in the form of the actual result that has been declared yeah none nta is going to supreme court so no read only one week wastes <laughs> so you can have various assumptions so we'll meet with more stuff regarding the counseling kind of sessions and the next step that nta is going to do with that so thank you thank you very much stay tuned and please like this session and subscribe to innate infinity land youtube channel so that we'll be coming up with more stuff thank you very much thank you